Well, good evening, guys. It's Chris, your YouTube daddy here. I'm so excited. I've got a new toy. You're going to love this new toy that I've got, yeah. It's, uh, what day is it? It is Thursday. <coughs> it's about nine o'clock. I've just finished at the arcade and cleaned it up. And my new toy got delivered today. Now, I'll tell you, I'll tell you stuff, the, the thing behind me new toy to start with. Everybody, you know, I've been doing YouTube for a couple of years, for those of you who've been following me, and I've always used my iPad. Now, everyone's complaining about the quality of my iPad. It's always covered in grease and uh, because it's in the burger bar, and uh, I can't do any editing on it or anything like that yet. Uh, so everybody keeps saying to me, you need to invest in a new camera. Now, I've always resisted to this, but what I decided to do was I thought, well, what I'll do is I'll wait till I've earned enough money off YouTube to buy myself a camera. So, basically, whatever money I've earned by you guys watching it, as you know, the more people who watch it, uh, the more adverts that go up, the more money you earn on YouTube. So, I thought what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait until I've earned enough money on YouTube and then go out and buy a camera. So, guess what? Oh, I got a camera. Na, 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 na. So that's my new toy. I've, it's still in the package. As you can see, it's not been opened yet. So there's a new camera. Now, apparently, this is a uh, uh, a creator combo. So apparently, it's got a microphone in it as well. One you stick there and a an extra battery on it. And I've even bought some extra data uh, gigabyte things. So, I don't know, this is 200 something gigabytes, I've got no idea. Not a clue. But this is the one that I, that I needed for it. 250 gigabytes, okay? So, this is the one that I needed for it. So, I've been having problems. As you're probably aware, if you've been following me, I used to have an old iPad. And it got filled up with storage because of all the videos I was doing, which it was only 32 gig. Uh, so, I just then decided... I earned a bit of money off YouTube, so I decided to buy an, up, an upgrade iPad, which had 64 gig on it, which is the one I'm currently using at the moment. But guess what? That's nearly full now. I, I keep, I delete the videos off it, and I, oh, I don't know. But anyway, the amount of videos I'm doing, the other applications I run, it's not big enough now. So I decided I needed to get a camera. Hey, hey! So I got the proper stuff. Now, this is the professional. This is the dogs, apparently. This is the, the top quality. Well, I, don't, I don't think it's the best of the best, but it, it's a pretty good one. Okay. Now, the reason I got this one <coughs> was apparently, so I've been told, what I can do is I just film on it, blah, 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 film on it, and then I could literally upload it. I put an app onto my iPad, and then I just upload it directly onto my, uh, where my photos and my, my videos go. And then I could upload it onto the internet straight away. So I'm still not going to mess about. I think it's like Bluetooth and it's across or something. I'm not quite sure. But anyway, it works in conjunction with my iPad. But all the storage will be on here. I think, Okay. That's the general idea. So, what we're going to do is we're going to open it together and we're going to have a look at it. Now, obviously, I need to then uh, go home and upload the, uh, the app on my iPad and then work out how it works, okay? So, that will probably take me a couple of days. But, let's have a look what we get for our money. So, I've got my own screwdriver. But it can't be that difficult to work. So let's just take the cellophane, the cell, the cellophane wrapper off it. That just proves it's brand spanking new. It got delivered today. And I've just not had time to open it yet because obviously I've been working all day. So uh, let's have a quick look here. How do we open this without breaking the box? Is there like, there's a thing here, is there? It's like Christmas. Okay, how do I open this? Okay, that must be. They don't make things easy to get into, do they? Okay, I think I think you break the seal here. Okay, maybe. Okay, I think ah ah that's it, that's it. There we go. There we go. We open the box now. So let's see exactly what we've got. Oh, it's even got a carry case. Ooh. So, uh, 
I'm so excited. Oh, look, it's even got a posh carry case on it. Look at that. Hey, look at that. How posh is that, eh? Hey? And uh, I, I presume these are just the instructions for it. So I'll need to get my glasses out when I get home to read them. Oh, my God. How am I going to read that? Even I'm going to need more than glasses to read that. I'm sure you don't need to read all that. I'm a typical bloke, you know. There's no way I'm gonna I'm gonna read the instructions. I'm either gonna work it out or or go onto YouTube and look at somebody else who's worked it out for me. But how am I meant to read that? And start with it in Chinese. Okay. Uh, ah, this thing looks a bit better. Quick startup guide. We've got a quick startup guide here. Ah, this looks it. It's got pictures. <laughs> That's good. So it's got pictures. So it looks like I uh, zap a, a QR code. So there's the, the setup. So, so I've got the setup bit on it. So, so that looks like the quick. Ah, right. Here's the QR code. So DJI recommended video video uh, editing app. Okay. And uh, the must-have app for GDI users. Okay. So these are the apps. So it looks like what I do is I zap them codes on me. I don't know how I do that. I'll work that out, yeah. And then it'll put the app on for me. Okay. So that, that looks pretty simple. Right, so let's have a look at what's in here. We've got a box here as well before we open the main box. And I've got uh, another battery with it as well. Oh, this is a, this seems to be a handle. Seems to be a handle to hold it. So this is a handle maybe. Okay, let's see what we've got in the pack. Okay, so we're just going to open the pack now. And let's see what we got. So we got a camera. Ooh, look at that posh camera. Eh? And uh, so there's the camera. And I assume the ah oh, the screen the screen rotates like that. Oh, oh, it turns on. Hey, look, it's moving. Ah, okay. So it, it's asking me to set it up at the moment. But what I'll do is I'll leave that until I uh, I get home. Okay. Okay, it's gone off now. Okay, I'll leave that till I get home because I don't want to. Uh, and I presume I'll have to fully charge it up and stuff like that before I set it up. So I need to do that at home. I just really want to see what I've got here. So I've got the, the camera itself. So it, I can see it works because it's, it's turning now. And then when I close it, it goes back to base, I think. Yep, there you go. So we know that works. Right, what else have we got? Now, this is a, I think, because I, I bought the one that's got a backup, because it's obviously got a battery on it, but this is a battery that clips into the bottom. Like that. So that's a spare battery. So there's already a battery in it. And then you clip the battery into the bottom. So it gives you a bigger handle. And it... Uh, let's go and clip it. Okay. Like that. Okay. So that's the battery. Okay. So that, that, that seems to be all, all in order. Yep. And then turn it round. Yay! Okay. And then I'll, I'll press that to take it out, I think. Yep, okay. I've worked that bit out now. Okay, so what else have I got? Uh, what's this thing do? I wonder what that is. Uh, 
I think I might have to read the instructions. I don't know what that bit does. Uh, obviously a lead to charge it up. I get that bit. Uh, right, what's here? It's always oh, just like Christmas Day, isn't it, guys? It really is. So, uh, ah, look, it's got, a little, it's got a little tripod. Hey, how cool is that? Oh, how does this work? Uh, where's the screwy bit? Uh, okay, I can see it's got a tripod, but I can't really work out how the tripod works. I've got a tripod there, and how do I connect it to the tripod? Ah, there it is. So, this bit, I can see this bit now. This bit screws onto this bit. Yep, there we go. And then I put this bit onto there. There we go. So that's when I've got it as a tripod. So I've worked that bit out now. Hey, it's all clever stuff, isn't it? Right, and then, what's this bit here do? What's this bit for? I will lay it all out so we can have a look on it all, to, all together. I'm just going to move all the paper, all the plastic out of the way, and the bits I don't actually need. Uh, I need that bit. I don't need them bits. Okay, so here I've got my... I'm assuming that's a microphone, okay? So that'll be a microphone, I'm guessing. It looked like, it, yeah, I guess it's a microphone. But I will look later on at the at uh, the descriptions. And what's here? This seems to be a fluffy thing. Oh, okay. This is the fluffy thing for the microphone, I think. So, uh Ah, there we go. That's definitely the microphone because the fluffy thing fits on top of the microphone. There's a, li there's a little hole there. And that bit there, I'll show you. Yep, goes into the little hole. And it's a fluffy microphone. So we've got the microphone there. Don't need that bit now. And there's just one more bit here. Uh, it seems to be a little bit. So as far as I can see... We've got the camera, we've got the backup battery, we've got the thing that mounts onto the stand. Okay, let me, I'm just trying to open this thing now. I'll probably do another video on setting it up, because obviously all I want to do is make sure that I've got the right parts that I need to have. Uh, come on, open up. This one. Big thing in there. Don't quite know what it is. Okay, come on, open up. Open up. What is it? Must be important because it's taking so long to get into. Oh. Okay, I think I've nearly opened it now. Uh, that's just the, uh, so what's this? I'm trying to work out what this is. Must be important, whatever it is. Absolutely no idea what that is. Maybe a lens. Hang on, let's turn this on. Let's see if it's a lens. Ah, it's, an, it's a lens. It's a, it's all called a lens. Okay, it's magnetic, so it it uh, it fits on there. Okay, there's obviously a reason for that, so we'll have a look at that later. Let's just close this up. So, and we've got the lead, and we've got the thing there, so I don't need... 
this lot, I don't think. So I've got the disruptions, which I'm going to need. So I've got to keep them. I've got my SIM card thing. And I've got my bag. So this goes into here, I think. Turn off. Okay, I think that's off. Then that goes that go into there. And does that go in? How does this work? Maybe it goes. How does this sit into here? Okay, well, I'm just looking at this. I think the spare lens goes into here. Does it? Yep, right, the spare lens goes into there because it's magnetic. So that's where the spare lens goes into. So, how does this work? Uh, so what goes into there? I'm trying to work out how it goes into here though. Uh, right, that's turned off now, so does that go there? No, maybe not. Maybe it goes like that. No, maybe like... Okay, that's how it goes. Right, got it. That's how it goes into there. So that's into the safety thing there. Okay, so I've got that. So I'll show you what I've got here, guys. Right, so what I've got is I've got my camera in the in the camera holder thing. Now I've worked out how it puts in how it goes in there. Then inside there I've got my lens thing. Then turn it off. So that's gone into there. I've got me leg things, my stand, and this screws onto it. So I'm assuming that is like a part of the, the mount. So what we'll do is we'll set, we'll set this up a bit actually, see what it looks like. So that goes into there. So, so there's my camera when it's on the stand. There we go. But it's got a proper stand. That's pretty clever, that, isn't it? I didn't, I didn't know it had a stand with it. Anyway, so we seem to have all this, and I've got a microphone, a proper microphone, so you'll all be able to hear me now. So, oh, we got a new toy. We got a new toy. So I'm just going to put it all away now. Right, uh... I think you have to like turn this off for it to go back to home. Okay, yep. Yeah. So that goes to home. That goes in there. And now we've got a bag to pull it all in. So I see that bit goes into there. Yep. Yeah. My microphone goes into there. Yeah, it's got a clippy thing for the microphone. That's good. Uh, my stand will go in there. Uh, my battery pack will go into there, I think. Yep, my fluffy thing will go into there. Uh, I seem to have a, a cord, but I'll put the cord on later. That can go there. And then my charging bit goes in there. And then does it close? It doesn't seem to be closing properly. Uh, it goes that way. It must go this way. It must go that way. 
idiot outside. Got people running up and down the streets, just hitting the shutters, thinking they're hard. Bless them, eh? So I'll put that back into there. Why is this not closing? Think your legs go in there, don't they? No, I'll put the legs in there to start with. Okay, anyway, so we seem to have everything. So all I've got to do now is I'll put this back into here. I'll put this inside here. That's the chip bit. That, that goes into the camera, apparently. And that gives me lots of memory. Because we've got memory, but not enough memory. He says, hopefully. So everything's gone back into the bag. Nice and safe now. So there we go. That's our new toy. Yay! We got a new toy. So hopefully, it'll take me a few days to work out how to upload the app and stuff like that. And stick it on the internet and whatever I need to do, yeah? So hopefully, in a few videos time, we're going to start using this obviously i'm going to need a bit of practice the whole idea of me getting it now was uh it's the end of season as of uh, a week on sunday and obviously i'm going to be on holiday i'm going to benedorm and stuff like that and i'm going to be doing a lot of filming in benedorm filming when i go on holiday to the states and i look stupid when i'm walking around with an ipad and obviously the problem will go along it so the plan was always to get a proper camera thing but as i said i wanted to make sure that this youtube malarkey was self-financing so i wanted to earn enough money off youtube so you guys by watching this yeah and watching the ads and stuff like that yeah you have helped to buy this and this is for all of us to use so i'll obviously be filming with it so you guys can watch it so hopefully there'll be better quality now i'm still not going to do any of this fancy editing malarkey because i can't be bothered with that because that looks too complicated and i don't really like the idea of fancy editing anyway i like just to film what i see talk about what i see no fancy editing no no masking around stuff just film it and stick it on the internet but as i said the quality can be a little bit dodgy the only thing i need to think about yeah which has just popped into my brain is i need to work out how i'm going to mount this in my car when i'm driving my car or i might have to just use the ipad for my car i'm not sure uh i'm sure if i uh jdi uh camera i'm sure if i look at the look on the internet it'll tell me if there's a car mounting bracket thing I'm assuming it will. I, I have no idea. I didn't, I didn't kind of think that far forward. And I'm also going to need a lead as well that goes from here to my cigarette lighter to make sure it's charged up while I'm driving. Because when I go to Benidorm, I've got this plan. I'm going to actually drive from Alicante to Benidorm, which is about an hour drive, and do a lot of driving around Spain and Benidorm and stuff like that. So I'm going to need to have all the kit and caboodle uh with me so my plan is anyway i'm going to send to park the first week that i break up for a couple of days to drop the uh the kids and the grandchildren off and, and karen and i'll be there for a couple of days so the idea is i want to start filming with this new camera while i'm in center parks and kind of get used to it because i'll be in the the chalet thing and i'll be able to sit down and get my head around it okay anyway so we got a new toy, we got a new toy, we got a new toy. It's a big thank you to everybody who watches my channel, yeah, because you guys have helped me buy this. So we're going to move forward now and we're going to try and make that quality a little bit better for you. But I'm not going to, as I said, I'm not going to be promising I'm going to be doing all these fancy effects and all this editing malarkey. I won't be doing that. It'll just be a better quality. I still won't be. I still won't be uh, messing about. I literally just want to film it, transfer it from this to my iPad, and then bang it on the internet. Okay, if you like this video, hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget. The more people who watch it, the more stuff like this we can get, and the better quality we can get. Because this is all about a team effort. Yeah, not just about me. It's about you guys. And I really appreciate your feedback into it and stuff like that. So you guys said I needed to get a better camera.
<laughs> for a long time you've been telling me that, yeah? So I've now got one. So all I've got to do is work it out. Okay, thanks for watching this video. And don't forget, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. See you later, guys. Because my goal is we got... I'm just changing something slightly. We've got 5,330 subs at the moment, yeah? Now, what I want to do is before the start of next season which is going to be March, so it's just over four months, yeah, I want to be hitting 10,000 subscribers. That's my goal. That's the goal of the team, the crap team and the Higgit team. I want to hit 10,000 subscribers. So I'm hoping this will help me. Thanks a lot. And don't forget, hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Bye for now.